agriculture is front and center at a new museum geared toward elementary school age children. The Bayou Country Children's Museum in Thibodeau opened about a year ago. Tayana Dequano reports they're hoping to attract people besides the locals. <laughs> the alligators in the swamp and board Miss Clotilde's shrimp boat. Just one stop on a trip down the bayou teaching children about Louisiana life from the Mississippi River down to the Gulf of Mexico. Upstairs they can learn about the different types of fish that are in the Gulf. They'll go fishing upstairs. Aboard the oil derrick they learn how the oil industry helps make their tennis shoes, basketballs and mom's makeup. This is Jenna Ackman's second visit with her son. It's a good place for these kids to come to and, and have fun and, and get to learn all at the same time. 14 months ago, when the Bayou Country Children's Museum opened, they intended to serve an eight parish area. The majority of their visitors are local, some from out of state. They expected about 45,000 visitors our first year. We hit that goal. The problem with children's museums and with a lot of nonprofits is that the admissions alone don't pay for all of the operating expenses. So, in addition to fundraisers and grants, the museum director says they plan to offer summer camps and have after school programs to bring in more funding. <laughs> What they'd also like to see is more people through the doors. Go get that bubble. Ackman says having something this close keeps her from traveling so much. We're taking them to the zoo, which is in New Orleans or, or Baton Rouge. Now she's hoping outsiders will also support this museum, especially since there's really no other place like it where children can learn about sugar cane on a full-size harvester, learn about Louisiana music, go through a hurricane simulator, and... Never go back into that house if it's on fire. You don't worry about toys. Fire safety. Come on, guys, crawl to the bedroom door. Hurry, hurry, come on, hurry, hurry. This area needed something like this. Tiana DeQuano, WAFB, 9 News. Museum employees say they're also hoping one day to expand the exhibits they want to put in. You have all the culture you see, right? They want more about Louisiana history. You can find a link to the Bayou Children's Museum on WAFE.com. That's practical stuff, too. It's great. <laughs>